Hi. Uh, I'm Joey Jeremiah. And might I say, that is a beautiful perfume you're wearing. My mom wears the same kind. Shall we? A lot of people worked on it. Thanks. Come on, you gotta be happy. That's a rule for birthdays today. Okay. Ta da! <laughs> you brought a cake? It's supposed to be for my birthday tomorrow, but I canceled the party. <laughs> so we can have it here. But it's yours. It's okay. My mother can bake me another one. We can share this one. Happy Sweet Sixteen, Elvie. Happy Sweet Sixteen, Alexa. Okay. <laughs> okay. Why does not work? You're gonna love it. <laughs> and now, for your personal viewing pleasure, the amazing, the incredible, MC Degrassi and the desktops. Yay! Uh... Hi, LD. I heard you're stuck in the hospital for your birthday. Boy, well, I know you're gonna get better. Me and my buddies, they made this up well, we're so gonna put you on the top. something like this. Hit it! Don't miss girl aunt. Her name's LD. She's a nice little girl. Good grass. We heard that she's. Thank you. Thanks. What are you doing here? I came to talk to you. We can talk later. I'm working. Shall. Why weren't you in school today? You shouldn't skip. It's really stupid. Later, okay? What's the problem here? Nothing. I'm Michelle's father. I'd like to talk to my daughter alone for a few minutes, please. If you have to, sure. Thank you. Michelle, don't be too long. This is the business. How did you know where I was? Brian told me. You talked to him? He doesn't like me much, but he does seem genuinely fond of you. Thank you. He's worried about you. And so am I. They called from Degrassi. They told me all about what was going on. I'm fine. I got the ring back. It's not mine, it's yours. When you feel you're ready, we'll talk about it. Michelle, you're a smart girl with a bright future. Don't throw it away to work here. Dad, I have to pay my rent. You know your room is still there. No, I'm not going back. I can't go back to your rules. I can't let you run my life the way you ran mom's. I know I've made mistakes, but I'm trying to change. Everything I did, I did my very best for you. It's not easy adjusting to life without your mother. You may find this hard to believe, but I love you. Now it seems I'm losing you. I don't want that to happen. I really don't. Hey, yeah, man, what you reading? That examiner was such a jerk. Why do I have to signal when there's no one behind me? So, you both failed. Yeah. She told me to change lanes, right? So I, I looked in the mirror and I signaled. Then this guy behind me decides to change his mind. I have to put on the brakes. She flunks me. She should have flunked the guy behind me. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, guys. Look what my parents got me. Isn't this great? Dynamite. Dynamite. See you later. 
I don't believe it. Nancy. I can't believe it. You're staying in the apartment, and he's helping towards the rent so you won't have to work as much? That's right. So what's the catch? There isn't one. I think he's finally starting to realize I'm not a kid anymore. I think he's lonely. I've invited him over to dinner Sunday night. Would you like to come too? I don't think so. Your dad and I aren't exactly ready to be buddies. Okay. 